Okay. Mem heim beis. Right. Um, start. Eish tome tukad al mizbeach. We're going from the various, from the posuk about in terms of the uh, the maro, the various fires you have on the mizbeach. You have okay different things. You know, where do you take the fire for the lefnayu dnim for the for the ktoris? It says eish tomid, eish tomid lemayo osin boy lechatanyo lechatanyo. So he says the pasuk, the gros says eish hamizbeach tukad bo. Okay, eish hamizbeach tukad bo. Lo stichper limer amrochah shni yishak ktoris sholtei elo. Um, where, did you, where did you take the coals from? You took the coals from the Mizbech HaKitzon to burn, to put on the Mizbech HaPnimi, to burn the Ketoros on the Mizbech HaPnimi, the inner Mizbech, on the Mizbech HaKitzon. Eish machtu menorah minayid, the machtu of Yom HaKipurim, when the Kohen Godel would go into the Fnai of the right? Where did those coals come from? Menorah, they would like the menorah, from where did the fire come from? Vidinu minayin. How do we know that it also came from the zbech achitzon? Vidinu nemro ish b'ktores. B'machto. Videmro ish b'ktores. Nemro ish b'machto benora. Mala alone is b'ach. Is b'ach achitzon. Just as the ish b'ktores come from the adam is b'ach. Avkan al mizbech achitzon. Yom Kippur. And for the menora also comes from the zbech achitzon. O klach the derech zu no. Zu nemra eish b'ktores, vid nemra eish b'machta u menorah, malala b'sobachlo. Af machta u menorah b'sobachlo. B'sobachlo means like, no, 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 which means, the mizbech ha-pnibi is what? Is somachlo mizbech ha-chitzo. But the, let's say, the machta, which is lefnai v'lefnim, it's somachta mizbech ha-pnibi. And the menorah is, is somachta mizbech ha-pnibi. So maybe you take it from there, right? Talmud Loma Eish Tomit Al Mizbech Lo Tzich Bech Eish Tomit Shem Marti Loch Lo Tele Brosh Lo Mizbech Achitzo. That's the reason. Lamadnu Eish Lo Menorah. So that's Eish Tomit. So Talmud Loma Eish Tomit Tuk Al Mizbech Lo Tzich Bech. Eish Tomit Shem Marti Loch with the ongoing fire, which Shem Marti Loch, which is the Menorah, which is the Menorah. Shem Lo Tele Brosh Lo Mizbech. The Eish, the Eish, which which is Tomit. Comes from that, from the Lord that's going on the menorah. Versus H. L. Menorah, to me nine. Right? H. Macht is not Tomit. But with the same idea, but the same idea. It alludes, it alludes to the fire ongoing. The Tomit. But what about the Macht? The Macht is not Tomit. Dinu, Nemre Ishbe Macht, Nemre Ishbe Menorah. Ma il halon agab mizbech achitzo, and afkana mizbech achitzo. Okay? O class there also no. Nemr eish b'ktoris, nemr eish b'macht, ma'la alon b'somuch lo, avkam b'somuch lo. Talmud lo v'lokach melo ha'machto, gach le'eish me'ala mizbeach l'fnei Hashem. Now what's l'fnei Hashem? To mizbeach is l'fnei Hashem. Okay? L'fnei Hashem, that's what, it, which is the Pesach Hecho. So what mizbeach is l'fnei Hashem, which is Pesach Hecho? This mizbeach ha'chitzon. Right? This is the machto. Lokam lo machto, gach le'eish mizbeach l'fnei Hashem. Yizu mizbeach shemitzoso l'fnei Hashem. Ve'en kul l'fnei Hashem. It is milifnei Hashem. The milifnei is lemitzos of the kulo. How is it misbeach achitzo? Why? The itzur lemichtov mal misbeach. The itzur lemichtov milifnei Hashem. What do you need? But say milifnei Hashem. Because Rachman misbeach have mitnei my misbeach 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 apnimi. Because Rachman lufnei Hashem. So that means it's it's in the chot in the chotzer. Because Rachman lufnei Hashem have a mino dafkim milifnei Hashem center. Because the misbeach was situated. It went to each side. The Mizbech was a certain width, it was 32 amas wide. So the center was centered directly opposite the entrance to the Hechel. Right? Mm-hmm. What about if you want to take the coals off to the right or off to the left of the Mizbech? Maybe that's not, it's not direct Lifnei Hashem. Havmida Davkum Lifnei Hashem. Avod Vahaygisim Haygiso. Emolo. Maybe it's off to the side. Not. If we need Mizbech, either part of the Mizbech, even if it's directly. In direct line with the opening of the hechol, it, it qualifies the gacholim the, which are taken. It's sufficient. Okay, Omer Abelozim Yishu Bekaporo Ben Kapar Kaporo. Omer Hayu Reb Meir Avery Olo Shini Tosro 
the the limbs of the ola which were left over, which means you put them up, normally you burn them during the daytime. Let's say they were left over, okay. and we're going to discuss in the moment. Let's say you have Friday's tomit, tomishol shal, tomishol bein arbayim. You sprinkle the blood. Everything has done before before sundown. So normally, when did you burn the limbs and the fats at nighttime? But now you have a little bit of a problem. Why? Because if you put it on the mizbeach, it's Shabbos. So we're talking about it's olas chol b'Shabbos. The tombe that you want to burn on Shabbos is, is a weekday korban. Yeah. If it's Ola Shabbos b'Shabbato, it's not a problem, right? If it's the tombe of Shabbos, of course, you do it. But this is the Ola Friday, which you could have put on the Mizbeach Friday. You did it. Could you put it on Friday night? Shabbos. Uh, which is Shabbos. Yeah. Could you put it Shabbos? So, Omer Rebbe Shemek, Harba Omer Yeremeo, Ebri Ola Shem Toshru, Osle Marochem from the Atzma Vesodron, Afilu b'Shabbos. Even on Shabbos. My Kamashma, what's the Chidush? Tanino. This is what Rablosa Bishop Kabar Remes in Smurses Mike Tinino said we learned the Mishnah Bukhol Yomo Yushom Arba Marochos. In the Mishnah, there were four different fires burning on the Mizbeach. Four Marochos. Omrev Olot Suchelopsuli. Yeah, first of all, what is that? We're speaking about when it says you put the Nitosru, there's aloha, there's certain types of things which are validate a korban. But if you put it, if you don't, you don't sacrifice. But what happens if you put it on the mizbeach? It says imodlo lo yerdu. If you put it on, you don't take it off. If there's certain types of psulim, okay? The of when do, when when do you leave it on? Shemosh or If before Shabbos, it already was the majority of it was already burnt by the fire. We're not saying it wasn't a coal, but the outer part of it already the fire already affected it. Lo, but if it wasn't affected by the fire, then you don't put it on. No, no, it fell out. Oh, fell out. Which, oh, no, which oh. means you make the special, you want to put it back on. If yeah. on, you can put it back on. But if not, then you don't put it back on. You don't put it back on. That's the first version. Let's see Rashi. Rashi over here. Okay, see. Omi Rabbi Ever Ola Shiditosu. Vlogar Sinon Olas with the Bach. Lo garcina ola shabbos, you know, not ola shabbos. The the garcina le my tenino, my tenino kaporuch le oslash mina shabbos, right? Well, then what's the question? If rebbeis come tell me shabbos that you put it on shabbos, so what's no? What's the question? I it's the mishnah. The mishnah maybe is talking about the weekdays. It's just chol yom ayisham arba marochus. Doesn't mention anything about shabbos, right? So therefore, if the gears will be shabbos. So if you tell me Ebru Shintos Osle Marocha, if the Atzma we're not talking about Shabbos, okay. So he says without the Afilu B'Shabbos, without the Afilu B'Shabbos, okay. So that what's what's the Chiddush? That it's the Mishnah. The Mishnah says that. So therefore the Gear says we without Shabbos. Bim Tov Hochi Porochle, Bechol Yom Tinan, because it says Bechol Yom it's Mashma including Shabbos, right? Afilu B'Shabbos the Hod Porochle. Right? Mm-hmm. That's the next Gemara's question. That's not the first. Tomorrow it's another question. That's also Tanino. Tomorrow it's two Taninas. First it is a mayor. I, my car, Tanino. Then afterwards it's another question. Tanino. Well, let's eke the Amri. That's the second eke the Amri. Let's read the There's another version. Echot Kshem Vachab Sule and Imoshlo Benor in in Ilolo. Vafilo Bishabis. Tanino. Vayon Chomesh. The Gemara is asking on Shabbos. That's, that's the second question. But according to the first Girsa, the first the first version, it's not asking Shabbos. You see clearly that Rameir didn't say Afilu B'Shabbos. Right? The question is not asking from Shabbos. No, the, you see, no, instead, but that's not it. That's not it. Right? That's, he says, That's next. That's, right? Mike Rashlon, the Komer Osele Marocha Bechol. One of them was for that. That he says the Kiddush of the Psulim. That they would make a Marocha for the Psulim. But which Psulim lo yerdu? The moment it ready becomes burnt, the majority becomes burnt, then it becomes Lach Shomazbech. It's not you're first putting it on to be makrav it. Im Olu lo yerdu means if you put it on, even though it's not Moshe Lenor, but it's there. But if it's already off, and I want to make a special Marocha to put it back, then it has to be, be Lach Moshe Mizbeach. It has to be rain. When is it called Lach Moshe Mizbeach? Moshe Okay? So if it's partially burnt, then you can't put it back. You cannot. It's partially. If it was burnt, 
you can't, right? It has to be rove, the majority. No, right. Doesn't mean it's a cold. No, I understand it. I understand. Okay. Tanina Yom Chomesh or Yom Kippurim. Let's go further. So the Ikad Biamri was Echud Kshirim Vechud Psulim. Imoshl Ben Or Eni Lo Lo. Lafilu B'Shabes. That's the other version. That's what he said. Whether it's Kshirim Psulim, Moshl Ben Or, yes. If not, not. And then, and that even B'Shabes. Tanina. It's we learn in Ayom Chomesh. Amar Avacho Baryak Itzrich. He has to tell me why. So that Mehani Mili Echud the whole Yom Kippurim with us Achur Shabes. If Yom Kippur comes after Shabbos, the Chaldi Shabbos craving Yom Kippurim, I will be empty Shabbos. Lo, but if it's already Shel Chol and it's Shel Shabbos, maybe not. Kamash Malon, no, yes. If it's Moshe Benor, you do it with Kippur and Shel. Right, right. Omar Rava. So Rava makes a statement. Man hide lo chaysh lekimchei. Havachol Yom Tenant. Rava says. The person who doesn't, who's not worth his weight in salt or in kemach, the lochash mekimchei ho b'chol yom tenan. It says b'chol yom. How could you tell me? Where is it? Check out. B'chol yom ho yom. I will flee to the rapuno. Advar kapor advar oro. But don't b'chol yom. Right, right. B'chol yom. Masdis nafka afil b'shabes. The rapuno sub b'chol yom mishabes. Right? Yeah. Right. Rubber says the whole thing's incorrect because it says, How could you tell me? That's what he's telling me. That's what Ramirez, that's what, uh, uh, Bar Kap- Rabbi Loh saying the name of Bar Kapora. That meaning, it's not, even even the Emsa Shabbos, not, it's not to be the Shabbos, the Kraven, the Yom Kippurim. Even the Emsa Shabbos, it's coming Fridays for, for Shabbos. So he says, that, that's the Chiddush. That's what Rabbi Loh he says, so what do I need that? It says, B'chol Yom. B'chol Yom Tana. What's the Mashmo? It's B'chol Yom. B'chol Yom is Mashma. Shabbos. Kasha. What does he have to tell me that the Eivori Yeola Shni Tosu? You you watch, you can put it on Shabbos, right? What's the Chiritza Mishnah? It says B'chol Yom. So according to Rav, what does Chol Yom mean? Chol Yom is, is Davka, including Shabbos. Including Shabbos, yeah. Say Kasha. I know, but that Rav is arguing. That, that's Opliga de Rafuna. Rafuna... That's why it's kasha, not a tiyufta. That's why. Yes, that's b'chol yom ho yudaram of tenad v'afilu b'shabes mashma. I understand. But that, that's a plea. That's what Rafun argues. I drop the om b'chol yom asnis and dafku. The Rafun is sub b'chol yom lebar mi shabes. Rafun says no. B'chol yom doesn't mean every day. Doesn't mean including shabes. You know, person says I come to work every day. But you work seven days a week. Every day I come to when you're supposed to work. I come today. Chol Yom means the day that you could do it. The day that you could do it. I do it every day. So Shabbos that you can't. Shabbos that you can't. So you don't do it. The day that you can. Every day they made a marocha for it. But Shabbos which you're not permitted. They didn't make a marocha. Chol Yom doesn't include Shabbos. Therefore he's telling me a Chiddush. Therefore the Chiddush is even Shabbos. The mission itself. Chol Yom can be interpreted to me not that way. It can mean chutz mi Shabbos. <coughs> no, so then, then you have a question then. So what's the Chiddush? It's a Mishnah. No, so that, that's, that's he's asking. That's Rav's question. Rav, that he owns B'chol Yom, means including Shabbos. So what do you tell me, a Chiddush? Okay, so Kasha. Rafuna says no. Rafuna says, Pligd <coughs> Rafuna. Rafuna says, factually, not. You cannot put it on Shabbos. Yeah, Yeah, mean, if you want to bring the Tomid, you want to bring a Tomid on Shabbos, you bring a Tomid on Shabbos. But to bring the Tomid on Friday at Sofa, which is Devorim and Pedorim, to, to bring it on Shabbos, that, that's Sofa. Tchiloso, Torah says, Tomid is Docha Shabbos. Tomid shall Shabbos is Docha Shabbos. But Sofa, but the Sofa shall carbon the Friday is not Docha Shabbos of Shabbos. You're not going to do it. 
you can't be makriv on Shabbos the next day, right? Omer Rava, then he said, "Pliga de Rafuna, da betchilos de Dochis Shabbos, so vein de Dochis Shabbos." Omer Rafuna, Tommy betchilos de Dochis. He says, "Tommy id betchilos de Dochis, so vein of my ain of Dochis." Now the question is, Rafuna says, Rafuna says, "Betchilos de Dochis, so vein of Dochis." Now Gufa, well, well, the Gemara will explain that what it means. Gufa, Omer Rafuna, Tommy id. Now, what does that mean? What's Eno Doche? Since Machlok Amoroim, what did Rafuna mean? Edo? Rav Chizdome, Doche Shabbos, Veino Doche Tuma. Yeah, it's Doche Shabbos, but if it's Tome, we don't. It's not, it won't be Doche Tuma. Yeah, Sof was not Doche Tuma. To be Makrev means. For Zrikas Dam, if you don't have Kohanim Torim, for the actual Tome, the Shechita, and, and the, through the Dam, that you do. And Shabbos also. But if but to be so makrif, to sofa, the evorim not. If you tell me, you're not doing it. You don't do that. That's sofa. No, 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 no. no. Tchilos adoche is a Shabbos. Vein doche is a Tumah. It's going to sofa. Eino doche. Sofa. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, 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 right. No, it's Doche Shabbos, but it's not Doche Tumah. The sofa, going to the sofa. Yeah. Rabba Omar, Rabba Omar, it's Rabba the Gersa, Doche Satuma. Then you don't No. Sofa is Doche Tumah, right? Mean Tumah, Hucho, but the Tibor, we'll see. But the Ivor Vidorim, oh, you cannot bring on Shabbos. Sofa. That's Sofa. But that's what being a Friday is. Not Shabbos is Tommy. Right, right, right. Right, right. Right, we're talking about Shalchol, Tommy Shalchol. Omale Abaye, so Abaye says, the Rabbo, Lidi Doch Kash, Rav Chiz Kash. He says, Your interpretation I have a problem with, and Rav Chiz's interpretation I have a problem. What is it? Doch Kash, what does he say? It's Doche Shabbos, but it's not Doche Tuma, right? That's Rav Chiz. Now, how do you know? How do you know a korban tzibur is doicha Shabbos? Because it's mordo, mordo. And how do you know tuma is huchu or chui It says mordo. It has to be born its time, regardless of what the circumstances. So mordov shok. If mordo means one, it has to mean the other. So how do you how, how do you differentiate split between between Shabbos and tuma? That's his kasha. Right, the same source. The Rav Chiz the kasha. Look at maishno tuma. Why does tuma come be, 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 even on the chesiv v'mordo? Why Shabbos is what Rav Chizda says so his dofish doche Shabbos the chesib mordo and he says Rav Chizda also is difficult because he says tchilos is doche no he says tchilos is doche so is not doche maish the chesib mordo a few Shabbos tumanami be mordo a few be tuma right. Both have the same, the same, the same problem, the same thing. Probably more. What he says is not splitting. You know, more the more you do it all the way. So Rashi brings two pshatim. Ma'inu doche. Einu doche satuma. Hechter chadov meimorim el zrikas dom lavod. When he says einu doche satuma, it means zrikas dam. Ain't a doche is a tuma means, but but the dam definitely you bring b'tuma. You would you would bring it to me. You understand the shechita you bring do b'tuma dam you bring including tuma Shabbos and that. But regarding hekter chalovim not they bring lishna chrino chiloso hekter chalov hekter chalov so for evorim the French would do chalovim and evorim shini tosru mebeeriv which were left over Friday bezeh shemati varishin nirabena he says no the first one's mashmatim. That it's going, it's, you know, it's the carbon of Shabbos. Carbon right. of Shabbos, that it's Eino Doche Zatuma. No, it became Tomei on Shabbos. What about the Lina? No, 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 it's not the Lina. No, Eino Doche Zatuma, period. It's not Doche Tuma. You, you discard him. And it, you, you, you Zurek the Dam, but you're not, you're not Makti, you're the Chalov, and you Murim. If no, you're not makter him at all. You're not makter him all. Maybe the zurka dam is too much. What? Maybe the zurka dam is too much. No, everything became tummy. No, but what? The dam. When he says, 
So it says, <laughs> that, <laughs> yeah, but the dam, no, but the dam you will be Zorik. The dam you will be Zorik. <laughs> he shakes it right away. So that that we're saying, it's, 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 Tchilos is Doche, Rega. Tchilos Doche means, listen, I'm telling you. Right, 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 right. Yeah, yeah. No, no, and Doche, Hekte, Chalov. No, it is. Regarding just. No, it doesn't, does, does, no, no, no. My in a Doche, in a Doche is a tumor. What? No, that endoch has a tumi means hekte chalav mei murim. Period. Hello, what is a doch has rikas domo bilvod? So we read it. Okay. So on that, omale lo li di kasha lo rafchista kasha. It's not difficult to call it my understanding or rafchista. Okay. Yeah, yeah. What what Rab is saying. No, lo kash, lo di kash, lo rafchis de kash, li lo kash, sofo kitchiloso. Sofo kitchiloso. Rabbi says, what? Rabbi said, rega, Rabbi said, doches atuma, veino doches a shabbos. Sofo kitchiloso. Tumo, the kitchiloso bar mitcho, right? Mitcho, tumo hu, sofo nami dochi. Shabbos the tchiloso labra mitchu Shabbosu. So v'lami lo dochi. He says like this: Tuma, I learn out so from mitchiloso. Just as let's say initially you want to bring the tumit, you bring it on Shabbos with tumit. The kohanim with tmeim, you bring it, correct? You bring so just as tchiloso is with tumas. If the korban's tumit, you also bring it. No, we're talking even hekta chalovim of Shabbos. Shabbos, Shabbos, right? At sofa, so you learn a sofa with chiloso. Just as chiloso, if the Quran were tome, you say it's irrelevant, you bring the tome. Same thing, if, if sofa is tome, you, you also bring it. Shabbos. Unrelated to Shabbos. That's, that, that's, that's tome. Good. Shabbos, Wait, Shabbos, Shabbos, something else. But Shabbos, if it's Shabbos korban, you don't have to, that's called doche. So we're talking about Fridays. So Fridays, where do you see that Hector Chalovim is doche Shabbos? Fridays, Hector Chalovim, should be, you should be able to bring it on, on Shabbos. That you don't see. Tumah, you see, that's, it's two different days. It's two different days. It has no Shabbos. It has no relevance to Shabbos. Therefore, you don't see the Hekta Chalovim of, of the week they come. You should be able to bring on Shabbos. Right, that's what he's saying. Tumah, they both have relevance. Okay? Wait a second. The Chilos Allah bar bit Shabbos is so for Nami Lo Dochi. Rav Chis Lo Kash is so for Chilos Lastly, Shabbos to Hucha Hibit Sibor, Sofo Nami Dochi Dochi, right? We find Tum is Hucha Hibit Sibor, so the Torah is it, because it's Hucha. Therefore, we don't differentiate between Sofo and Chiloso. Shabbos. Shabbos is Hucha. Wait, wait, wait. Therefore, you can be Makri Friday, Zemurim, on Shabbos. Tuma Dechuyi Hibit Sibor. What's Tuma? That's Dechuyi. So Rashi says, what's the chuyah mean? It's like a bedievet. You have no choice. So tchiloso dika kapora dochi. You have to have the korban. So that's rikas dam. So for the lav yikur kapora lo dochi. So you don't bring it. I'll, I'll, tell, I'll tell you what I have a problem with this. With them. We pass in la locho in main bosa in dam. Right? We rule in main bosa in dam. So if, if, how could you be zorok the dam if you can't be makre de murim? Right? There's no bosa. Right? Yeah, we hold. Uh, what happens if you, you, you have the, the you shecht and the meat becomes all tummy, or goes lost? Nitmes or it goes lost? You can't be zorik the dam, because the Torah says you have to have baser and dam. So over here, what are we talking about over here? What? Yeah, and but we're saying and now it says, but you can't be mocked in chalov. We're to, we're going to call him that's tummy. Right? Rav Chista. It's Doche Shabbos, but it's not Doche Tumor. No, no. No, no. No, but you have to have. It doesn't make a difference. So, very simple. He, when he was Zorik the Dam, they weren't Tummy yet. As long as, as at the time of this Rika, there's a Varmti Maktir, it's what happens afterwards. 
At the time of the Zerika, you have to have Bosser. It doesn't mean to the Lemaise, you have to be Maktirit. It may, if initially you shech, then it was, before you did the Zerika, it was never. Nevdu or Nitmu. So at the time of the Zerika, you don't have, you don't have Ivorim. Then, you don't, then, you don't have then it's Posel. The the Zerika, they wasn't. Subsequently, they became Tommy or Posel. It's irrelevant. Everybody agrees it's Posel. Afterwards. 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 Otherwise, you couldn't do the Zerika. You couldn't do the Zerika. No, no, no. I'm, I'm explaining to you. If you hold, you don't say the Chiyah and Shabbos where it became Tomei, right? There's Tuma. Tuma, Tuma, Tuma. So I'm saying if, if actually after, before this Rika, the Eivor became Tomei, you can't be Zorak the Dam. You have, what do you Zorak the Dam? There's no bus, it can be mocked here. Teretz is, he did the Shechita, the Kabbali did the Zorika, subsequently it became Tomei. No problem. So therefore, since it is Rika, it was supposed to be mocked here. Therefore, therefore it's, it's good. That's right. That's exactly why. That's the reason why we don't allow to, we don't we don't allow it to be brought because Tum is the is not So once it's torture, so there's no reason why you can't put the Emurim of the what of, of Fridays on it. It's, it's torture. Even though I have a difficulty. Shabbos is Hutra because it's, that's all the Shabbos for Shabbato. So Shabbos is Hutra. What does Friday's carbon have to do with Shabbos? If I want to bring a carbon Yochan on Shabbos, could I bring it? No. You can't bring it. Only right? Only carbon Tzibur. Right. What does the Mordo of Shabbos have to do with the Mordo of Friday? Mordo, sure, Friday it's Mordo. And that Friday has to be brought. Okay, so you bring it. Shabbos carbon has to be brought. He want to bring the Hector Chal- Chalovim of Friday and he bore him on Shabbos. What does that do with Mordo? I don't understand the whole discussion over here. Because since it's it's Hochub is Tzibur, they have Sufa Nami Dochi. When you bring the Korban on Friday, it's not. No, 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 no. You could have been Makrev during the daytime. You could have. It was Nitosro. So what is he supposed to do? So you can bring it Friday night, Maybe not. But I'm asking, that's your question. We're saying not. Yeah. That's the machlokas here. Right. So what happens? Kidding, so l- let it become possible. No, but I'm asking, what's the Rav rationale? Because sure. since Tchilos is doche, so is also doche. Because it's hutra. What does hutra have to do? Hutra, I'll give you an example. The Rishonim say in Shabbos, Mila Bishmini. Pikuach Nefesh is the question, hutra dechuya. Right? Person is deathly ill to violate each other. Hutra shayl, why? Because... Kuch Nefesh doesn't have to be Shabbos. But if the Torah says, Biyom HaShemini Afil B'Shabbos, Torah says, if the child is born Shabbos, Torah says, you circumcise him Shabbos. So we show him that that's Hutra. Torah says, when it comes to meal, it's like Shabbos doesn't exist. Because Torah says, specifically, right. you bring the, you bring, the, you, sh- you mild the child on Shabbos. No Kuch Nefesh, you could say, it doesn't have to be Shabbos. Well, the person has to be definitely, it can be any time. Right. So right. therefore, we have a question, Chaybet, that's, that's the Chuyah. Right? You could say that's the Chuyah, right? But over here when Torah says Mordo, the Shabbos definitely, the, 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 the Talmud of Shabbos is definitely Hutra. It's Mordo. Mordo. You've got to bring it regardless. I couldn't care less whether it's Shabbos. That's Hutra. That's what he says. But what is the Talmud of Friday, the Evorim B'Dorim, what does that do with Shabbos to be Hutra? Maybe it's the Chuyah. It's not, our whole discussion is the Mordo issue. So I don't understand the, 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 the rationale. I said it's covered. But what's the modo? What's the modo? What's the modo? When the Torah says modo. No, the reason no Shabbos is Hutra is just because of the Mordo. The Mordo of Shabbos is nothing. But what is the lump? From where do I derive the Korban Sibur is Hutra? Where do I find the Korban Sibur? What's the Mordo? Only relevant to Shabbos. Why? Why? Anything that's Korban Sibur. Even though, even though the Mordo, even though the Mordo only has relevance to Shabbos. Only two things, Tum and Shabbos. Tum and Shabbos. Doesn't say anything else. Yes, but the 
It's time. Everyone's. It's not mother's time. So if it's in time, it's in time. So now you brought us Friday because it's in time. The same in time. The same, the same in time, whatever left over, the same in time is going to the next Okay. That's it. Because it's in time. Otherwise, what you say is very big question. But the, whole, the whole discussion is not big. What's the discussion? The discussion. So we learn Modo every day, that's, that's Betuma. Tuma has relevance to every day. Right. Right, Shabbos only has relevance to Shabbos. Okay. Because it's included in the same word. Same word, Modo. Even though the Modo of the weekday has only relevance to Tuma. Right? The Modo of the weekday has no relevance to Shabbos. It only has relevance to, to, to Tuma. Correct? No, 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 no. He learns in Torturah. Torturah. And I'm talking about Shabbos, Shabbos, Shabbos. No, but he's learning the main, even the Friday's carbon is, is sutra. Yeah. Because it's included in the same word, even though for Friday it only relevance to Tumor. I understand. No, no, no. He said, because it's the same word. The even though the mod of the weekday is only Tumor. But it's the same word. Since it's derived from the same word. So we, 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 we right. That's yeah, it's, it's, uh, Rav, uh, about Yaakov, does that, uh, on 46A, does that have relevance to what the carbon name? So it says that Yom Kippur falls, uh, the day after Shabbos, can we work backwards then? That everybody agrees that. That's, that's Poshit. But can we go, go back? That's Poshit. No, no, he will go, go hold to Shabbos. Hold to Shabbos is something else. That's Chelvi Shabbos Kriyim Yom Kippurim. Nobody argues that. Nobody argues that. Itmar. Interesting. Shaila. Hamachabe Eish Machto Umenora. If you extinguish the fire on the Mizbech, what do you violate? It's a love. It says Lo Sichbe. What about you have the Eish of the Machto? You have the coals in the fire pan that you're going to bring into the Kochi Kadoshim, and you extinguish the coals in the fire pan, not on the Mizbech. Are you in violation? Well, let's say you have the, the fire burning in the menorah and you put out the candle before it goes, it's supposed to be put out. You extinguish it. Abayo Machayev. Why is it Malkus? You lie before Malkus. Terse is Losichbe. Rav Amapotr. Why? The Kviya Brosh... The Samar says like this. The Kviya Brosh... If you extinguish the coal when it's on the Mizbeach... Because that's... That's Eish Mizbeach. Right? Tukad Losichbe. Okay? It says the fire on the Mizbech says it's what you should not extinguish. So that nobody argues. You extinguish it on the Mizbech, Kayu. He pligid the Achti la'aro, the Kavu. He took the coal, put it on the, on the ground, and he extinguished it on the ground. It's not on the Mizbech. Abayo Machayo, why? Eish Mizbechu. Doesn't say Eish Alha Mizbech. The fire, it's the fire of the Mizbech. Rabba Potter, cave the Notka Notka. Once you remove it, it's not called the fire of the Mizbech any longer. It's a fire, it's a coal. Its origin is that, but it's not Eish Mizbeach. Elohodi Omer Rav Nachman Omer Rav Okay, so that's that's the argument. Elohodi Omer Rav Nachman Omer Rav Rav Hu Hamorid Gachel Mizbeach. Rav Rav Nachman says name Rav Rav Hu. Person takes a coal off the Mizbeach. Vikibo Chayuf. And you extinguish it, you Chayuf. So seemingly, Kemant Kabai. That's Abai. Of course, it's called Eish Mizbeach. I feel the same Rav. Hoshem Lo Intikul Mitzvos Ohoch Intikul Mitzvos. That's the difference. Oh, see, there, a person just takes a coal off the Mizbeach. Still called Eish Mizbeach. You have no right to take a coal Of course, when it comes, you're supposed to put it back. But over here, when you put it in the fire pit, it's called Eish Machto. It's assumed a different function. Let's say a coal falls off the Mizbeach, and it's, it's hot. What are you supposed to do with that coal? You're supposed to put it back on. So, if you're supposed to, what is it called? Of course, it's called Eish Mizbeach. But over here, once it's been detached, because now it has a function, it's called Eish Machto. It's called the fire.